The Rocks won Jian DDH978 is one of South Korea's distinguished Chung Mugong Yi Sunsim class destroyers. Built to provide the Republic of Korea Navy with enhanced anti air, anti surface, and anti submarine capabilities. Named after the founder of the Goryeo dynasty, this vessel represents a perfect combination of cutting edge technology, formidable firepower, and advanced naval engineering. In 2026, the ship remains a key component in South Korea's naval strategy contributing both to national defense and to joint operations with allied navies. Built by Hyundai Heavy Industries and commissioned into service in the early 2000s, the ROX-1 Jian has undergone multiple upgrades to maintain operational effectiveness. In the ever-evolving maritime security environment, its displacement of approximately 4,000 to 100 ton standard and over 5,500 tons at full load provides a balanced platform for endurance and combat readiness. With a length of around 150 meters and a beam of 17 meters, the destroyer is designed to operate efficiently in both coastal waters and deep-sea missions. Powering the Wangjian is a combined diesel or gas propulsion system that integrates gas turbines and diesel engines to deliver speeds exceeding 30 knots. Ensuring rapid response capability in high-threat scenarios, this propulsion setup also allows for efficient cruising during extended patrols in terms of armament. The ROX-1 Jian is equipped with a variety of advanced weapon systems. The primary gun is a 127mm OT Omelara naval gun mounted forward, capable of engaging both surface and aerial threats. The ship carries the RIM-66 standard missile SM-2 for long-range air defense, launched from AMK-41 vertical launching system. For anti-ship warfare, the destroyer employs SSM-70K Haseong missiles offering precision strikes against enemy vessels at significant distances. Anti-submarine warfare capability is provided through torpedo launchers and the KASRX system, designed to neutralize submerged threats quickly and effectively. The vessel also features close-in weapon systems, such as the goalkeeper CIWS, providing a last line of defense against incoming missiles and aircraft. The ROX-1 Jian sensors and electronic suite include advanced radar systems for air, and surface search, sonar for submarine detection, and electronic warfare capabilities. For threat detection and countermeasures, these systems integrate with the ship's combat management system, enabling coordinated operations and rapid targeting. The destroyer's helicopter deck and hangar allow it to operate naval helicopters such as the Super, Lynx or AW-159 Wildcat, which enhance anti-submarine and reconnaissance capabilities. The onboard aviation facilities also support search and rescue missions, making the Wanjian versatile in both combat and humanitarian operations. Crew accommodations are designed for extended deployments with modern living quarters, training, facilities, and operational spaces that support around 300 personnel. Habitability and ergonomics have been prioritized to maintain crew efficiency during long missions. Over the years, the ROX-1 Jian has participated in numerous joint exercises humanitarian missions and international deployments, showcasing the Republic of Korea Navy's commitment to global maritime security, upgrades to its systems, including the integration of newer missiles and improved sensors, have kept it competitive with modern destroyer standards. The ship's role in the ROC Navy's KDX the program reflects South Korea's broader push to maintain a Blue Water Navy, capable of power projection and sustained overseas operations. From a strategic standpoint, the Wangjian contributes to deterrence, maritime domain awareness, and rapid reaction forces in the region, ensuring that South Korea remains prepared for any maritime contingency. The combination of speed, firepower, and advanced technology ensures that it can operate effectively in multi-threat environments, from defending the Korean Peninsula to supporting allied forces abroad. In terms of operational flexibility, the ship can seamlessly transition between anti-air warfare anti-surface warfare and anti-submarine warfare roles, making it a valuable asset in dynamic conflict situations. Its propulsion and endurance enable it to remain on station for prolonged periods, while its advanced communication systems ensure coordination with allied navies. During joint missions, the ROX-1 Jian also benefits from South Korea's robust shipbuilding and defense industry, which provides local expertise for maintenance, upgrades, and logistical support. This domestic capability ensures that the destroyer remains in peak operational 
conditioned throughout its service life, while also contributing to national industrial and technological advancement. In 2026, the estimated price for a ship of this class, factoring in construction, weapon systems, and electronics would be in the range of approximately 400 to 450 million United States dollars. Depending on specific configurations and upgrades, this investment underscores the strategic importance placed on maintaining a capable, modern naval fleet. The Rocks One Jian stands as both a symbol of South Korean maritime strength and a practical, battle-ready platform that supports the country's defense posture. Its balanced design allows it to respond effectively to emerging threats, while its continued upgrades ensure relevance in the rapidly evolving maritime domain. The destroyer's combination of combat power, versatility, and technological sophistication makes it a cornerstone of the Republic of Korea Navy surface. Combatant. Fleet. For anyone passionate about naval technology, defense strategy, or the evolution of modern warships, the ROX-1 Jian offers a fascinating case study in design excellence and operational effective. This, its legacy is not just in the steel and systems that make up the vessel, but in the role it plays in safeguarding national interests and supporting international maritime stability. Make sure to subscribe so you do not miss future in-depth reviews of advanced military and automotive technology. This is SK Auto Reviews, bringing you the latest insights, reviews, and detailed breakdowns of the most powerful machines on land and sea, asterisk.